What's up? What's up? Welcome to Let's Be Real, everyone. I'm your host, Joe Mambu. Is your boy Big Shirt? Oh, it's your boy Big Shirt. What's going on, everyone? <laughs> All right. So uh, this week we're talking about uh, the review of both championship games. The frauds, the fraudulent passes, the fraudulent non-pass interference. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, later in the episode, we got actually a poll going on. Uh, An interesting poll. Yeah. Very interesting. Paul. But before we get to that, let's talk about um, the AFC Championship game. It was it was a good game. Pat Mahomes did a great job of throwing every, uh, of uh, throwing um, his team back into the game. Yeah, basically. Yeah, he he basically did. But Brady but, Brady did it again. There was a bullshit. Brady did it again. Listen, Brady. Brady did it again. Get he does it. This is, this is what he does, Brady man. It was a, he was average. He was average. He only threw he, he only threw one touchdown. He had two NOs. One was off a tip pass. So, I mean, I get it. You know what I mean? Brady was kind of mediocre, but he's usually mediocre in road games, and it was very cold in Arrowhead. But, um, Listen, man, James White and, and Sony, 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 Mike, Michelle, Michelle. Sony Michelle. Listen, man, they had great games, man. Especially Sony, man. He, he's running the ball, catching the ball out the backfield, and then you got to give it up to Burkhead because Burkhead was kind of just the one who just was like bulldozing in. It was like, yep, game's over. That sieve of a defense. Listen, a fucking sieve. Listen. How the hell you know what's coming? Yeah. You know exactly what they're coming to do. Two minutes left. Brady got all that time. Listen, it's Brady time. Captain Cool is on the way. Shut up. <laughs> Fucking Brady time. Captain Shut Cool up. is on the way. He ain't you know no Captain Cool. He ain't no Montana. He, That's why I said he, he ain't better, no Montana. Better. Montana had Jerry Rice. This dude is doing it with Julian Edelman and a broke down Rob Gronkowski. Uh huh. With a, in a Civ division. He's been playing with look, for, in, for 15 look, years. I get it. I Civ division for 15 years. Listen, I get what you're saying, but when it. His, pre, his regular season schedule is a preseason schedule. It's preseason. The it's, Jets twice, the yeah. Bills twice, yeah. the Dolphins twice. That's eight, that's and then six you get games. your. It's yeah. like college. You get your little cupcake games yeah. in between. Yeah, and then look, you get your hard games but, going out there. And then by the time you hit the playoffs, that's their regular season. And we already know they're going to play Houston or San Diego, who they beat the bricks off with, yeah. where, which I knew was going to happen anyway. You remember that time when people thought San Diego was like going to be this most dominant team because they always did something with the powder blues on? Oh, oh yeah. No, yeah. No, no. That was, <laughs> that was very times. long ago. Man. That was good times, It was man. good times. That's, that's when LT was there and Antonio yeah, Gates, yeah. legends of the game. Yeah. Thank you for your service. I wish they would have got you a Super Bowl. I know. I wish I did. I too. wish they would have won one. Listen, Brady's a hell of a player, man. And uh, listen, as you can see now, <clears throat> the running game is more prominent. With, with the Patriots, they not he's not airing it out like, like how he used to. You know what I mean? Oh, hold on, my bad, my bad. Are you nervous, sir? No, I'm not. I'm just uh, I'm a little tired. I just drove from DC. So. Okay. But uh, yeah, what's what's your take? What, why did why do you why did you hate the? I thought it was a great game. It, the, the game was good. Yeah, the and, game was good. But yeah. again, every time we watch the Patriots, it's like something. With the refs. <laughs> oh. Something yeah. with the refs goes wrong. Yeah. It started with the Raiders, RIP Manny Fresh, of course. They screwed the Raiders out of a chance to go into a championship game in 01. Yeah. That talk rules bullshit. Everybody know it. Yeah. Spygate, they done spied on this. Man, Genie sat there and basically snitched on the Patriots because he knew what oh, was going yeah, on. Oh, yeah, that's right. The whole Spygate thing. I mean, come on. Yeah. But I, you know what? I, do they need that much fucking help? Do they need that much fucking help? Listen, but late in the fourth, there was that pass interference play on New England um, that favored KC. I so, do not recall. Listen. I do not recall. I know you don't because you hate the Patriots. I, this, I, that's not, I don't hate the Patriots. I, say, I just don't recall. Right. I don't you, recall. You, and also the D4 penalty. Which I, I which would to me was BS. Yeah, I don't care what anybody say. Oh, he's off in like six inches. What about? Come on, really? Oh yeah, Listen, come on, really? He was, really? Though. He was, <laughs> he was. But what about that Hogan catch though? No, that was no, that was boss. 
Yeah, that was that was boss. And I thought I, 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 I don't give these. I, that was a boss yeah. catch. I thought Andy Reid really messed up, kind of challenging that because no no because no. to me, I thought he caught it anyway. I'm mean, like yeah. he caught it. No, but I'm saying if you thought that someone who gets paid millions of dollars to see the same thing should see the same thing you see. But, but listen, they have, I get it. It's a championship game, right, so you, got, you want to try to get it in it by any means. You got to make sure everything is right on the tee. Yeah. Even the what, even the element play when the when he when they, when the punter punt the punt the ball to element. Yeah, it looked like he touched it with his thumb, with his left, with his right thumb. Yeah, but you had to really look and really really got to look and see it. I, th- I yeah, thought you, it touched you, the Wait, are first. you talking about the Edelman on the kickoff, or are you talking about... On the punt. On the, on the punt, where right. we thought Edelman touched it. Right. Okay. And I thought it touched his thumb, but you have to make sure that you you got, you got get it right. It didn't touch him. I, to me, it looked like it touched him, but yeah. I, said, I said at that point, you know what? It's kind of hard to really judge. Yeah. You feel me? So I say, I let that go. But the roughing the passer penalty on Chandler... On, Yo. On Jones, I... I I was disappointed because I'm like, you can't even breathe on this fucking guy. But you know what? You the, can't breathe on him. You know what the crazy thing about that? So you know, in the Saints game, it, the, and, and that <laughs> listen, no, not just the pass interference, but in the Saints game, there was like, so what happened to Brady with that roughing the passer? He still had the ball in his hand. Yeah, the same thing with Breeze to me. At near the end of the game, that caused the inno, the interception. Oh, that come on, Joe. That really, that, come on. That could have been. Come on, man. You don't think no, that could have been a no. roughing the passer play on the Rams? The roughing the the the, the play that changed the whole game was the pass no, interference I know. play. I'm, I'm That's sa- it. I'm saying. That's it. I'm saying. I get that, but what I'm saying is that play when Breeze got hit when he threw that last interception, mm-hmm. right, to give the Rams. What the he ball. do? A sky ball. This guy, yeah, and um. You don't think that was rough in the passer? No. No? No. They the, Look, those plays, no. that play and Brady's he play le- look kind of He released the similar. ball. He released the ball at least. Brady didn't even release the ball. I guess. He yeah. never released the ball, bro. No. Yeah. Oh, um, my God. Uh, uh, rough in the passer. Like, cry me a fucking river. Yeah. Hey, Aaron Brockovich looking motherfucker. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, Aaron Brockovich. Please. <laughs> oh, my goodness. But, um, yeah, that, I mean, listen, man. I don't know. Pat Pat's their quarterback for a long time because he played really well in that game. Damian Williams did a hell of a job. Oh yeah. yeah you know yeah. what I mean? Oh, yeah. uh, you know what I mean? Um but the Patriots did a really good job of shutting down Tyreek and Travis Kelsey. You let know me what tell I'm you saying? let me tell you something what happened in that game also. Yeah, what happened? Andy Reid got out coached again. Well, I mean He got out coached and <laughs> Eagles fans know what I'm talking about. You know it. You know Eagles fans about. know what I'm talking about. I'm not Eagles Because there was a Super Bowl, which he played in with Donovan McNabb, where he didn't let him loose. You got to let Mahomes loose. He got you here to this point. Yeah. The first half, this, I don't know what plays to run down. This you is not the was, offense. This is not the offense I saw. Well, you thought it was conservative. conservative it was too conservative. Ball, ball call, uh, play call. Too conservative. Yeah. He's like Marty Schottner happened to me. They always get super conservative. Yeah. But then in the second half, Mahomes had to pretty much will the team. Despite the play calling, yo, listen, wait a minute. He was throwing side balls and on, everything, man. man. Yo, Mahomes is a hell could. of a talent, man. He is the future of the league. Kermit the Frog. That's right. Man. This is Kermit the Frog. Kermit anyway, the Frog. He is the future of the league. Period. He need to get them completions up there. No, 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 no. 16 for 31, 295, three touchdowns. No Enos, great, but Mm-mm-mm. listen, a couple Mm-mm. more completions. That, that, that's not the game was not on him. It wasn't. The game was on the defense, the it sieve wasn't. of a defense. It wasn't. And and and, I, and and Eric Berry, my God, I know he tried because he was playing with an Achilles injury. Yeah. And he tried so hard, but man, when they picked on him versus Gronk, man, I'm like, God damn it! Yeah. And I knew they're gonna go to him. And by the way, Tony Romo, kudos to you, my friend. Why? Wow, what's up? Because he called the whole goddamn game. Oh. He called the whole fucking game. Well, he was a signal caller for quite a few years. I so. understand that. But to do... It's not like Bill Belichick giving him the whole fucking play. Nah, I know, here, I know. Read the plays from my, for the audience. For them to know what we're doing. He's not. But Romo... 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 I, I saw some clips of him this season. He was actually pretty well. It was, it was actually really fun to listen to him call out these plays he, before him. Also because he loved the game. Yeah. When you, when you love the game... Sad he never really did nothing in his suit. Because was, I... Be, 
I, and I'm saying to myself, how can this man have all this knowledge, knowledge and not win? Listen, ten other people on the field, B. Well, if Des, on... what if they would have called the catch against with Des Bryant, maybe we wouldn't be having this listen, discussion two days. Listen, as a Packers fan, I was cool with the call, but it was fucked up because that's when Des, that was a catch, bro. Des, yeah, it was a catch, and Des was never the same after that shit. Yeah, damn. All right, but let's move on. We're gonna talk about the uh, NFC Championship game. You don't like the outcome. I didn't really like the outcome. I wanted to see KC go. Of course, but you know, whatever. Tom Brady, you yeah, know, blah 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 blah. blah, blah. They're gonna sit here and start, you know, right. giving him all. Ceremonies and shit all over the place. Well, you know, Fuck here. as they deserve nine Super Bowl appearances. Farce. <laughs> okay, so the problem I had with the what, NFC. Okay, what, what was your gripe here, sir? Uh, not only the pass interference, but there was the first two uh, Saints drives. They had a chance to score. There was actually one drop pass by a receiver. I forgot the receiver was number eighty-one on the Saints. Okay. Was that drop pass that would have gave them ten and zero because the first drive they kicked the field the first two drives they kicked the field goal, uh, and I think that even though they were scoring, kind of put them behind the eight ball because then when they went into the half, mm -hmm. it was like the Rams could still smell it, you know, like the Rams still had that opportunity to um, to come back in the second half, in which you know they totally did, you know. The Rams were never out of it. It did. They, they yeah, just, they were never out. They of were it, just no, out of no. sorts in the first half. Yeah, you know, it, it didn't look crisp. It didn't look smooth. Yeah, Gurley said he played like played like trash. He did. He had the one touchdown, but he did play hot garbage. No, no, to a man. Himself, I'm not even like teasing him or nothing like that. He said to a man himself. No, no, I know. He, yeah, I know what you're talking like, about. He, he said he yeah. played like a dog, and C.J. Anderson signed it. Hitchcock came in, and you know. You know, spelled in for yeah. for a little bit, kept kept the game moving a yeah. little bit, kept kept it on schedule until you know Goff came in and made some terrific throws. He did terrific throws. He did. Wonder right. Brandon Cooks at, at before the end of the half. Steve Jobs again? Nah, I'm not Jobs. Is this, this the time. bird box all over? <laughs> it. Nah, it's not the bird box. I hope. Not. But um, but like, but yeah, like he, yeah. he made passes over. Yeah, the, he made he made great passes. The crazy thing I like though is that. The crazy thing was, my father lost some track. But um, stay focused, my man. Stay yeah, focused. He he he's a young quarterback. So remember, uh, golf threw an inno to Demario Davis mm -hmm. the first drive. Easily, I mean, the Rams defense was really good, but it it really could have been a thing that this young gun of a quarterback. Mm -hmm. Because he's playing in the dome and you know, you know he's he's going against the legendary Drew Brees could have faltered. But the Rams did a good job of do, uh, stopping the Saints on the two jobs and only letting them accumulate six points. Right. Yeah. You know I mean? and, and, and for me, the defense started to get going. Yeah. When Indomitian Stew started to really get the Drew Brees, yeah. that's when the game started to turn. Yeah. It started to really get get in the gear. Then you then you had um, Aaron Donald getting to play. Yeah. Khalib, yeah. But then the luckiest man in the world, Ooh. Roby. Who made the hit on? Oh yeah, he is yeah, the luckiest man. man in the world right now. Because if they would have called pi, the game's over. Game over. Yeah, because then they had, you know, because they had to kick another field goal off of that, and it was what twenty three at that point. It was no, no. I'm sorry. At that point, it was uh, seventeen twenty. Seventeen twenty. That would have been a touchdown. I'm pretty sure Breeze would have got it in there. Uh, I think he would score. I think. I think yeah, he would have scored. Especially, yo, but been over. my thing, what I enjoyed most. Well, uh, but hold on. Yeah. I, I cried for you, New Orleans. I cried for you because right after that play happened, I went on the um, blog and I said, yo, no no, no flag ref, no pass interference. They're like, ref. nah, son. If you want. And the ref is standing right there like, yo, dude. If you want, I do got the clip of the pass interference. We could look at that right <laughs> look, now. I, I don't Listen, let's not hurt. The, the New Orleans Saints fans no more. No, I'm I saying. think they've seen. Listen, they've been through a lot already. They already had the miracle. In, oh come on, come on, yeah, guys, yeah. L really. Listen, come on. Can we? Can come on? You know, yo, the ref is standing right there, and he don't see we'll nothing, bro. Clip. And he's like, yo, he's not even playing the ball. He's not playing the At ball. All. He's just playing a receiver. <laughs> And yo, he did the right thing. When you see the receiver eyes get big, you knock the shit out of him. Like, you fuck him up. You know right, what I'm saying? Right, but you have to do it within the rules. Like, yeah, you got to do it within the rules. He just bowled him over, bro. Yeah, he just, steam, he just steamrolled over him. Now, oh, God damn. My thing about that play, though, what? was that if you look at the pass initially, 
Are you? Listen, listen. It's a pass interference. Right. But my thing is the way Breeze threw, threw the ball, I don't even think Tommy Lee would have caught it. He would have caught it, bro. I don't think he would have caught Bruce it. Drew Brees ain't that inaccurate. Because, no, he's not inaccurate. He's but, not inaccurate at but all. But look at, look at the, the most part. If you look at the position of the corner, Roby, the ball, Brees threw the ball to his. Like if, if, it's if, a swing pass, bro. I get it. But if if Roby was turned around, right? Mm -hmm. Say if he was turned around to the ball instead of facing Lewis. That would have been pick six. He, yeah, that's what I'm saying. It would have been a pick. You know what I'm saying? But the fact that Roby was so focused on Lewis. He just said, yo, he saw his eyes get big. I'm pretty sure under that helmet. You know what I'm saying? And Roby just cracked him. And Roby was like, yo, I'm not giving you a chance. I don't trust my hands to turn around. Listen, I'm going to crack you, and hopefully the ref don't call nothing. And then, you know, someone slid the briefcase under, and they was like, yo, we Gucci. <laughs> also, also in this game, why the Rams won yeah. was because the chain snatcher was back. The chain snatcher. A keep to leave. Oh, okay. Chain yeah, snatcher. yeah, yeah, yeah. Michael Thomas, I ain't hear Michael Will Thomas' snatch name. Will chain. Yeah, no, ask Michael Crabtree what happened. Yeah. No, I know. Listen, <laughs> ask Michael Crabtree what happened. Listen, I know. Looking like a fake Maxwell. Get the hell out of here, man. Saints still ain't had no no running game. I mean. 46 yards combined with the two starting backs. Against Sue and Donald. Yeah, Donald's it's hard. Come on, yeah, man. yeah. That, those are two. Kamara listen. was going off. They bet yeah. Kamara was their best receiver. He was their only receiver. Yeah. He We're, was getting off. Ted Ginn, three was only three. Ted Ginn made a big yeah. catch going down the stretch. He did, yeah, he made a yeah, big he catch. Did, he did, yeah, he man. couldn't catch a call that first, but as soon as he got with Drew Brees, his yeah. career's taking off since yeah, then. Yeah, listen, well, you know, you got to throw the ball accurate for something to catch it sometimes. But he, listen, he, Ted Ginn always had that speed. He, had, he always had. He always that had speed. that speed, but he he, he couldn't catch a call. Yeah, yeah, but the Rams did a stellar job. Yeah, they, they did a stellar they came job. Back, man. They did what they had to do. Listen, I thought the Saints was going to have. I thought playing that dome, Drew, would have lit him up. L listen, everything was right. The referees fucked it up. Period. They, they did. They, they did. It but it, to me, it would have been either that pass, if Ro if uh, Roby was turned around, would have either been, like you said, a pick six or incomplete pass. I think the ball was thrown a little bit too low, mm -hmm. and I think Roby was, Roby was in front of him. Mm -hmm. Roby was in front of him enough where Lewis wouldn't be able to catch the ball. So... Passing the fairest play, yes, but they lucky they didn't just end the game. It, uh, to me, it would have just been a pick six. All right. You know what I'm saying? So we got the Super Bowl matchup. We got the Rams versus Tom Brady and New England Patriots, blah, blah, which blah, is blah, cool. Blah. It's going to be boring. I mean, it won't be boring. It's not going to be boring. But the talking, I'd rather the Saints. The talking of this GOAT business yeah. will be boring for me. Yeah, I'd rather, I rather the Saints. Um, Very tiresome. So we got a poll uh, that we want to talk about. Uh, coming up and also we would like you for you to comment in the comment section during uh, our uh, podcast today if you don't yeah, mind yeah. no doubt about it you could do all that you know if, uh, if you have any questions or anything about the topic we're going to talk about next you know hit us up let us know what's going on we'll read them on the air for you yeah all right so let's um next we're talking about we all know all-star weekend is coming coming up pretty soon mm -hmm. um well hold on, hold on. Go ahead. Do, do that thing. Do, what thing? The, the poll. Oh, yeah, yeah. So this is the poll we're talking about. The poll is basically, as we know, John, James Harden this season has been going on a scoring onslaught. Uh, nobody can't stay in front of him. His percentages aren't the best because it's really hard to shoot a step back three. <laughs> you got to have good core to do that. Good but, core? He, tr he, he jumps like two, three times. Yeah, so like he, a get, he probably just he gets to gather on that third step. But So that's a trap <laughs> right now. Yeah. <laughs> no, but he about? doesn't just have his back step. He has a side step. You know what I'm saying? But it's still a travel, bro. No, no, the side step. Traveling, look at bro. the side. Look at James Harden's side step. That's not a travel. Okay. But um, Go ahead. with with the score onslaught that James Harden is going in, uh, the poll is basically saying, will James Harden surpass Kobe's to uh, point total of 81? There is a second half of the season to be played. We know players get wear down. Uh, during the second half, they usually use that all-star break to rejuvenate themselves. But uh, is it possible that James Harden will surpass Kobe's 81-point game total? Uh, and that's the poll. Yes or no? You can even leave a reason why or not, and you could get our opinion after the poll is closed. I'll be I'll be on there if y'all yeah. want to talk about it. You know. Yeah. But what for me, real quick, before we get into the whole yeah. basketball all-star yeah, thing, ahead, um, James Harden to me can score 90. 
Nin- I really think 90 he can score what? 90 points. He pro- mm-hmm. I think he can score 90. If he re- if he gets a bad enough team like the Atlanta Hawks. What's his... Let me see. It's career, I think it's where I had 60. He had 62 at the Garden. No, he had 61. Well, 60, oh, 61. One, one, one point. Nah, sorry, right, listen, Whoop-dee-doo. listen. I'm just, here, I'm just here to tell you how... Right. Well, he scores. That's it. All right. You know? He, <laughs> he, 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 to me, can score 90. If he yeah. gets a team like Atlanta, something like that, he can get the 90. Oh, I, I was... Oh, man. People from Atlanta don't... Um, don't like when you talk bad about their team. I, so I was in. They the, suck. What you hell you mean? I was in. Uh, hey, Atlanta's fine city and everything. But oh, so it, his career high is sixty one. Sixty one. But it, I was in. I was in uh, D.C. and like I met someone like this person from Atlanta, mm-hmm. and like you know I was like talking about like going like to different stadiums and like me and her were talking about um just like you know. The Atlanta, she's like, oh, you should go to Atlanta Hawks. She's like, I'm from Atlanta, and I was like, I don't, I don't know. Their team is pretty bad. But if James Harden came there, and he probably would score ninety, maybe. I think he can get to ninety. You know, because everybody, nobody thinks he's gonna get to hundred. Well, you know what it is. I gotta check how much minutes he's averaging, because you know what I'm saying that's no, another he, thing. He, son, he had forty. He had forty something at the Garden, son, at halftime. Mm. He had about 45 at halftime, bro. Listen, James Harden is a wizard, but 90 is very difficult. But, okay, we're going to talk about now the all-star starters. Okay. Okay. To me, uh, what I want to ask you, is there anybody on that list? I don't know if you've seen the list. Is there anybody on that list that you believe doesn't deserve they have the to starters be on and that. the reserves out no the reserves haven't been announced yet so but just the, the starters, starters just the starters I mean, this, right now i mean they was talking about luca probably being a starter in luca there. doesn't des- luca doesn't deserve i don't think he's playing playing phenomenal he's definitely running away with rookie of the year of but course. i don't think i don't i think because what they have him as a forward but yeah. he's a forward right mm-hmm. so your forwards are lebron anthony davis no, Anthony well, Davis not, is a not, reserve. Not, I'm just thinking about overall. All right, so let me see. Your forwards are George, LeBron, and... I can, uh, I can see replacing Paul George. Huh? I, I can see replacing Paul wow, George. Wow, you definitely haven't been watching I, Paul I, I, George I, 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 play this season. Oh, who, playoff P, who finally made a game-winning shot for the first time in his career? He's more, he, listen, it ain't the playoffs yet, so we can't... It's only halfway point. So right now we're just talking. About, we're talking about all star starters. Okay, you got it. You got it, brother. We Go ain't talking about Go ahead. You the got playoffs. It. You got it. You got it. All right. Go on. So I don't see him. I don't see Luca starting over George, and I don't see him starting What's over the LeBron. All, uh, like um, the vote. The people voted on this, of course. Well, yeah, yeah. But, I but mean, obviously, I, 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 for me. It would have been cool to see Luca. We know Paul. Oh, get and him. Kevin. He's not getting. He's not. Ooh. He's not. Kevin Luka, Durant. Yeah, he's not getting over those well, three. Well, Durant and LeBron, around. yeah. You think George? I think George. Luca, to me. Luca. Yeah, people fa- might call me crazy, but so the crazy thing is, I actually have the rankings. Um, the fan rank for Luca was really high. He was number two, but the players. Well, of course, you know they, they they're gonna do the the order and stuff like Listen, that. Listen, the cool. players was, cool. the it's players cool. had him at number eight. It's cool. And the media had him at number six. It's cool. Cool. George was a four by the fans. Mm-hmm. He was a four by the players, and he was a four by the media. Okay. So to me, Luca's been Luca's been amazing to watch. I actually want to catch a Mavericks game. Yeah, man. I want it because that guy is really. I think he hit Showtime, a game winner, man. game winner, Showtime. the other night against Detroit. Showtime. You know, or like a, cl- a clutch play against Detroit. And now him and Dennis Smith Jr. are now playing together well. Well, the crazy thing is they're talking about moving Dennis No, no, Smith no. Jr. They're not moving him. The, it would be the, the, the plan is that they're talking about uh, moving him possibly to the Knicks. I don't know. Wouldn't that be a sign It would be nice. It would be nice to we have him. should have drafted him in the first place. Yeah, it would be nice to have him. But he'd still be under his rookie contract. So it would be really yeah. cheap to, to keep him. But um, but, uh, so you, so you look at the list. I say Luca to me for Paul George. It could be no really? Paul, Paul George is gonna get it anyway. That's crazy. That's Paul crazy. George is gonna get it anyway. That's crazy. Paul George is. Doing I would like to see something different. Paul George is possibly MVP candidate. Oh whatever, so, whatever, listen, whatever. whatever. It's the regular yeah, season. Whatever. You keep talking about playoff P, but the key word yeah. in that is playoff. It ain't whatever. the playoffs yet. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. All right, so what about no, Paul, Don't get me wrong. Paul Jones is a hell of a player to me. Yeah, no, I, 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 when he when he when assert he, when, himself. When he, yeah, he he always tries to play too cool for me. You know what I mean? Like he don't care about the game enough. But 
No, no, don't say he don't care about the game. Don't I said enough, that. enough, no, enough. No, no, he, no, he care about the game. All right, okay. He care well, about you the game. Hear, you hear dogging him about playoff people. All when, right. When the play, he don't show up. That's what about, it. What about the guards? What about the guards? The guards so are the guards right. is James Harden and no, Steph Curry. And ain't nobody moving. Now. Ain't nobody. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, come on, man. I, love, I love Damian Lillard, but nah, Damian nah, Lillard now ain't coming close. Yo, but. if he was an East son, he'd be a perennial All Star oh, all, all the time. time, all the time, all the time, all the time. He's in the era of Steph and James Harden and Westbrook. Listen, the one I feel bad for the most is Michael Conley because Michael Conley is consistent all the time, but yeah. he ain't no playoff. He, I mean, he ain't no uh, All Star. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of. It's kind of it's kind of tough for Michael Conley, and they're talking about now. Now you got uh, Memphis talking about trying to ship him and Marcus Saul, so they they they're, they're going to be in total they're rebuild. They're dismantling so. it. Yeah, they're going to be in total rebuild. So that's for the West. Obviously, the teams didn't pick because the Cavs got picked the team, but these are the players from the West. Um, next, we have the Eastern the Eastern um, All Stars. So East, anybody you see here no, that it's as Embiid as uh, um, Antetokounmpo, Antetokounmpo, Embiid. Kyrie, Leonard, and Kemba. I'm so I, yeah. I'm so glad Kemba is starting. Uh, I know it's a small backcourt. I, I don't care. I'm well, glad not for really Kemba. because you don't know how the Cavs right. is going to pick, pick the team. But. but I am I am happy for Kemba Walker, man. He has yeah. worked so hard to get to They're this point. They're playing in now, Charlotte. Man. He's balling out of control. You know what I'm saying? And he and he looking at Michael Jordan every day. What, he, he, what he, that he, mean? He gets put. He he, he pushes himself. You see, when he see Jordan, he want to push himself because Jordan pushed himself, push, push, push himself. himself as as a player. Yeah, you know. So every anytime you see greatness right there, you want to push yourself. You don't. And he's the owner, son. Yeah. Well, listen. listen. Well, I, I'm just happy for him, man, because he's worked a real hard to get to this listen, point. Now. Right now, Hornets. Right now, the Hornets is in the eighth seed. Right. Uh, in the but East. he, he still bad. deserves it. Still deserves it. He still it. deserves yeah, it. Still it. Uh. Uh, who do you do you think anybody replace anyone from that no, list though? I'm fine with that. You cool? It's cool. Even Kyrie? No, he's been injured. Kyrie's been injured. No, I'm saying, do you? No, no, no. Oh no, no. Kyrie's a starter. No, no, yeah, yeah. No, I said everybody's good. Oh, everybody's, everybody's good. Everybody's okay, good. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Chill. Mm, I don't know, man. There's one guy from the West. Let me see the. You see, the thing is, they don't do centers. The, so the center position that's the problem. Is dead. That's the problem with me because I would move if they did the center position. That means Jokic would be. It in. would be Jokic. Yeah, it would be Jokic. Be starting. Uh, for me in the East, Kyrie's having a great year. There's nobody. I mean, especially did what he's having an All Star type yeah. season. Um, you know. I mean, it's not really much. I mean, you just gotta wait for the reserve to come out to see who really got snubbed. Yeah, I can't even. As you, much as I love, yeah, I don't see nobody in the East right now replacing. No. Replacing the two nope. backcourt guys. Nobody. Nah. Victor Oladipo's injured. He might have been the guy. Kyle Lyre. Maybe Bradley Beal. But his fan rank is always way too low. Because no because he plays the Washington, no one knows about him. Per se. I don't know about I that. I mean, they know about the Bradley play, the Beal. Play, the players yes. love him. Yeah, yeah, the players love and him. And the media course. loves him. They have him ranked But you don't have the fan because where he plays. Yeah. You think D'Angelo Russell gets a reserve yes, spot? Yes. Absolutely. The snitch. The snitch getting a spot, baby. Oh, my God. The snitch is getting a spot. A man is not his mistakes, his past mistakes all the time. He all right, Confucius. Mistake. Thank you, Confucius. You know Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I've, oh, listen, he's been playing. He's been balling. He's been balling. Ever since he came to Brooklyn, he got the Brooklyn attitude now, the Brooklyn style. He looks like he's a dude who got mad VC. <laughs> what? And just, because, like, look at him in his initial season with the Lakers. Right. And then look at him now. It's like he just grabbed like all the VC he can, the VC packs in 2K. Oh my God. And he was Yo, just God. like, he got the tattoos, you know what I'm saying? He Yo, got, come on, bro. He got the new hairstyle, you know what I'm saying? I'm surprised it's, he ain't playing with grills in his mouth, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, listen, maybe they should. I don't know if he should. That might hurt. Like no, if somebody they gonna hits hit him you, in the mouth. Listen, you, you play ball, they hit you in the mouth sometime when you play. Well, I'm short, so when you driving amongst either. the trees, you 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 get hit in the mouth. I always get hit. But shit, how much time we got left? I don't oh is that oh yeah, for, oh, we got five minutes. One, one minute, sir. One minute. One minute. My bad. So we got I was wrap looking this up at now. the clock, that's the time. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, come on, man. But uh <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, we got one minute. What do you want to talk no, about? We, we, we gotta wrap it up, bro. What are you talking about? Wrap it up then. You know what to do. Wrap it up for me. Go oh, ahead. Oh, thank, thank you for watching. 
you know? That's it? You know I don't do this shit. All That's right. you. Uh, all right, guys. You try right. to set me up for failure, man. I ain't trying to set you up for failure. You tell Supposed me what to people. do, so I'm saying go ahead. But, uh, yeah, I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another episode. Thank you. Uh, you could definitely hit us up on lbrstalk at gmail.com with get, qu- questions get, and comments. Hit us up on, on the blog. I'm always on the blog. Yeah, yeah. So hit that up, LBR blog on F on, on Facebook. Yeah. How's that poll looking? I, I we'll do post it, you know, we'll do the poll for next episode. But, but no, no, we, we, yeah, we're good. Yeah, but uh, yeah, you definitely hit us up. And we have our YouTube channel, LBRS Sportscast. Uh, you can definitely uh, iTunes as well. Yeah, you could check. You could check the check the the video of us and audio there. of us as well on um the podcast. Just type in "Let's Be Real Sports." Also on YouTube, type in "Let's Be Real Sports." Yeah, anything, yeah. anything, Google plays. All that stuff, let's be real sports, it will pop up. Yeah, man. And uh, I just want to thank you guys for tuning into another episode. And uh we'll see you next Saturday. We'll be here Saturday. Yeah, Saturday we'll be back because no one's gonna listen to us on no. Sunday because it's the and, Super Bowl. And, and we'll be doing our be Super Bowl special next week. Super Bowl shuffle special. No, no, we're not doing the shuffle. Don't listen to don't, that. Don't, All right, peace. Don't bye, 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 bye. Come on. Bye bye. Peace.